Hi guys, I'm Steve from Snug Under Floor Heating and in this video today we're going to be looking at our FME. Now this mat is specifically designed to go under carpets, laminates and engineered wood. So the main advantage of this mat is the whole thing is completely foil based. So with, when, when you have a, a wood finish that you want to dissipate that heat out so you get a nice even coverage of heat. With wood, you don't want to get kind of wider spacings where you would then get kind of hot and cold sections of the mat, which would then warp the wood because then it would heat up in different times. So the foil really does act like a, a shield to, to dissipate that heat out so that then you do get a full even coverage. So with this mat, we give a three mil thick foam, which goes down on the floor first and then you would then lay the mat foil side up. So on the, on the mat, there's uh, at the edges, there's one side where you can't see the cable and another side where you can see the cable. So on this one, the, the side up is where you cannot see the cable. And so the idea of the foam is then that the cable can then sink into it. So when you do put then um, a point pressure, so that might be through, uh, through a laminate or if you've got the carpet, that then it, it stops the cable getting damaged. It allows the cable to sink into that foam. So, it's, um, so that's the main advantage of the FME. So once again, you can then lay the FME on our insulation boards. Once your insulation boards will be fixed down with uh, our, our special um, therm screws, which are, you would have three at the top, and then five rows, so you put 15 screws in per board. If you were going um, for a, a, a laminate, you have then the option, sometimes uh, the wood might uh, come with a soundproofing membrane, if that's the case, that will go down next, and then you would. Or you can lay your wood directly on top of our FME. So it's designed to, to do whichever system you want. Now, when it comes to this mat, this mat can only be used as a form of secondary heat. And that is the reason, um, that the reason for that is the fact that wood is limited to 27 degrees. So because uh, the wood can't overheat, if the wood overheats, then it will, it will expand too much and then you'll start getting bowing and cracking. So we have to limit this wood to 27. So because of that, that, then we can say that it can only be used as a secondary form of heat. So there would need to be some other form of heat in the room when you are going for a wood or laminate finish. That's it on this video and this is our FME.